Welcome, guys. So today I introduce a really interesting equation, interest interesting probability question. Basically, is what is the probability that quadratic equation x squared plus two bx plus c has real roots? So basically, this this problem copied from the fifty challenge problem in the problems the probability with solutions. So I think this uh, problem is really interesting. So what we need to assume is that uh, we randomly choose B C from a real number. Okay. So in order to have this have real solution, we need the discriminator is larger than zero. So we need for B larger or less equal to zero. So we need for B squared minus four C greater or less larger than zero. So we have B squared larger than C. So this is the condition. Okay. So what we have is that uh, this is the B is is then C and the B squared equal to C. And then in this region which has B squared less than C and then it is other region is B squared larger than C. So all we need to know is find the ratio of this ratio of this large blue region over this uh, large blue region over the whole uh, com uh, whole complex plane BC or the whole XY plane and then uh, and the estimated ratio and the ratio is the probability. Okay, so to do this, uh, it's very easy. That uh, let me see. So we can close this. Close this, close this, close this. Okay, so I define this is x, and then this is also x. This is also x. X x x x x x. Okay, and then we need to find the area of. I need to find the area of this. Uh. Of this, let me see. Hmm. Okay. So I need to find the area of this region, oh, that is red region. So this is our goal. Okay. Okay. So simple question, calculus. So since this is x, so this must be uh, square root of x. Okay. So this area is more this area I call it one I call it one the area I just from zero to square x uh, b square db basically is b to the cube over three square x to zero so it's x three to the 1.5 power divided by three and also for this so this shaded red region the red region basically is square root of x times x so it's 1.5 minus this one times 2 because you have left or right so basically it's 4 times this one okay uh, let me go to another page so the red part is for x 1.53 and the total part and then the total the total whole area is 4x squared because 2x times 2x so the area is 4x squared so the the remaining parts basically the blue region is what we want basically it means that uh, b squared less or larger than uh, less greater or larger than c this part is 4x squared minus the red so the probability to have the real roots is that uh, blue divided by the area and then we take a limit x to infinity okay so simple question we have is 4x squared 4x squared minus 4x 1.5 divided by 3 
So it's obvious indeed that when x goes to infinity, then this this term is one, and this is just three times square root of x to one. So x goes to infinity, which is zero. So that means the answer is one. The answer is one. So that means the prob basically basically all the basically you choose any b or c then most of the time the probability will be one and the probability and the for for the comp the probability for the complex roots basically is zero but but you can still pick some b and c which you have zero so basically this is the sense called it major zero so i think this uh, question is very interesting so i share it to you guys and uh, be sure to subscribe to my channel i will see you guys in the next video